Midnight Run, and today we are re re looking at Cave Story. Uh, <laughs> I've tried this so many so many times now. This is the third time I'm going to try to actually record this, so I'm gonna at least try to act surprised for you guys. Now, this is a game that you can. There's two ways you can get this. Uh, it's available through websites that the uh, through patches and modifications that make this game originally from Japan into English. They go through these mods and go ahead and get gamepad support. Now, as you can see, it's all in English now, thanks to Studio Pixel, uh, where this game was released back in two, two, uh, December 2004. Now, the other way to get this game is through Steam. Uh, it, you can pay $9.99, it'll give you achievements, so many other features, and uh, it'll give you a whole bunch of other crap you know, that you can get, and it is so... This game's actually pretty in-depth for how simple it is, That's how simple it looks. Uh, so let's go ahead and start a new game. Alright, so at least this time I don't have to actually skip through... This, this time it doesn't skip through everything. From somewhere. A transmission. Connecting the network. Logged on. Executing chat algorithm. Sue? You there? It's me, Kazuma. I managed to get away somehow, but I have gotten lost. I found a shelter, but there's nothing here. If you can get hear me, please answer. Please? Alright, now, like I said, this is the thir third time I recorded this game. Uh, with that, I, or I'm trying to record this game right now. It seems to be working pretty well, now I'm able to monitor this. Uh, notice that I actually have to put this in window mode in order to record it, because if it was in full screen mode, it was not capturing it. And uh, even then, I have to capture it as a, uh, as a window in as a game application. I think it's because it reduced to the draw and everything. Uh, but I've gone from using FSplit to open, open broadcaster software, so I'm still, like I said, this is brand new, it's a new experience for me, so, uh, from what I've debated out so far, you can save your progress, continue on, uh, pressing down is an action for everything, it's like, if you've played Mario's Missing, it's like pressing a certain direction in order to do certain actions, so to save the game. Restores your health at certain points and things to loot on. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and. Uh, and I cannot set the game volume down. Uh, but I'll go ahead and. Uh, sorry, I'm having someone actually help me out with this whole testing thing now. Uh, anyway, so. Going through this door. I don't know how much louder I can make myself, but uh, we'll see how this goes. Okay, so these blocks and everything here, we need a gun in order to actually. Let me see what, what, what I can do about this. Uh, hold on, guys. Sorry, bro. These different settings going on. <laughs> Audio. I cannot turn the volume down, it seems. So, I'm going to have to go about this a little bit different. Let's see. Yep, so anyway, I'm going to have to go. Let's go ahead and start moving down this way. So I'm using, it's got gamepad support here. Oh, god damn it. First time I've done that. So, well, there's your surprise for tonight. My surprise, anyway. Alright, so we're gonna go through here, move in here. 
Uh, we're gonna cut through here. First cave. All right. So we're gonna kind of make our way across. Oh my god! Again. Oh my god! I am having a terrible experience with this game. As fun as it is. Uh. All right. Let's go ahead and. Let's go ahead and do this. Uh, move the microphone a little bit closer to me, and uh, I guess so. Can get through here. Uh, support, support. Can can is 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 my voice okay now? Alright, this thing here pretty much adds life to this life capsule. Well, my support's not really telling me if I'm doing okay with the voice now, as the sound's a little bit better. But, uh, I'm assuming it's, it's better. Whoa. Ugh. Alright, let's go this way. Alright, so we're going here. I see this old guy that's just kind of like snoring here, snooze fest, yeah. And so we go ahead and be a robber to him, take his Polar Star gun, and now that we've brought this up, um, alright, there we go. Searching for Sue. One user Sue found. Sue! Please respond! They're looking for you! Are you asleep? Your brother is so lonely. Alright, so going back to this, as you can see, I now have a gun, so if I press A, it starts shooting. I'm looking bad. Uh, anyway, press right button, right, or right uh, bumper, however you want to call it, and it brings up a menu that's very similar to like a Zelda menu. Like the Zelda Link to the Past and everything. Uh, but this game, is, oh my goodness. I'm definitely going to do like a Let's Play on this game after uh, I get done with the midnight run for it. Anyway, back to this. Before I completely jizz over myself and uh, orgasm over this this game, uh, go ahead and go through here and go there and, go and make it through. All right. So obviously, also there's an air meter. And you can probably notice right now. So uh, I tend to not want to drown. I drowned the last time I tried. Go through this. And there we go. So every time you get one of those hard capsules before it increments your max health by the There's another one we'll get later on. Actually, let me use a kit. Can I shoot these? Ooh! Can I shoot the spikes? Can I shoot the spikes? Alright. Uh, or you know, okay, so I'm gonna move in here. I don't know where that's safe. Just be just like half out of run through. If that. Uh, oh, okay, there we go. Oh, okay, I got him. Alright, so there we go. Oh, there, there. Okay, so you see this eyeball here? This, this is a trap door. It's not, it's not a real nice little door. You can open. Gotta, gotta go ahead and just kill this guy, otherwise, he will just, just wreck your world. Okay, I finally hit level 2. I have not heard. I have not hit level 2 at all before that. See you! Answer me! I'm so hungry. There's nothing to eat, and I've been reduced to feeding on cockroaches. <laughs> well, that was a joke. But uh, if I have to, though, I really will. Oh. Hand over the key. No, I won't. Are you trying to protect Sue? She's a stranger. She's not one of us. Sue is a good person. I'd never betray her. Toriko? When the doctor comes, you know he'll take someone away again. If we don't turn Sue over, it might be you he takes instead. But... but... The key, Toroko! <laughs> oh, hey guys! Oh. <laughs> Alright, so talking to, uh... this guy. What? You're not an enemy? I thought for sure that was them. I'm king. I'm number one in this village. 
Not that it means a whole lot, with only six of us left. Well, seven if you count Sue, but she's not really one of us, though. She's just an outsider who showed up recently. Okay, moving along, um... Let's go ahead and... Alright, so this is the reservoir. And, uh, ooh, look at that, I can kill myself. Oh god, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Uh, 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 uh. We're okay! Alright, moving on. Uh, oh, god damn it! I'm having terrible experience. Okay, there we go. Moving across to this guy. So, yeah, no. That's the cute girl who stays cooped up at the office house all the time, right? She showed up here not too long ago. Found her washed right, right here in the reservoir. She doesn't seem to like us much. Don't know why, since she's an amiga just like us. Alright, so we go in here and we find this this locket. Spoilers before right before we get it, but uh, you know. Oh! Oh my god, if you level up. Okay, so the the more bullets you shoot, the when you level up. Okay, I gotta know that. It's kinda cool. Okay, anyway. Give me the key! No! <laughs> oh god. Okay, so let's do uh, it. You're not getting away this easily. Well, apparently he just did, buddy. Alright, so... First off, before moving on with this, we're gonna go ahead and just explore the wood. Oh, you started me, Sue. Oh, right. The girl in Darcy's house, right? She's living with Toriko. Trick girl, that. She says she's searching for a sky dragon. Dragons that saw the skies. Do those things really exist? Okay, so, moving on. Uh, 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 no. Okay, so we're gonna go up here. And uh, over here I noticed that there was a new map. Yeah, let's go down there, there's a treasure chest that has the map in. I'll get that in a second. Do not entry. Okay. I'm Jack! Number two around here! The door leads to the Marika graveyard where the hero author lies. Well, mushrooms, why well, am I here? You ask where the mushrooms have been springing up here at the graveyard, so we'll guard the door to make sure that they don't get out. Alright. So moving on, we're gonna go down here and get the uh, get the nice little treasure chest. And we have no idea what the treasure is in. <laughs> oh, look, a map system. Ba -da -ba -ba. All right, so pressing X would open the map system, which shows uh, obviously your important. One can't move around with a map like that; it kind of pauses it. You're in the Mega Village, though, so we go in here and you notice that there's uh, quite a few things that can fill this place up. All right. So moving on. Uh, oh, before I do all that, there is one more thing. Yeah, let's get that other health capsule that's up here at uh, well, Yamashita Farm. So first of all, we're gonna save here real quick. Okay, nice little disc. Do you save game? Yep. Game save. All right, moving on. We go back to Mamiga Village and we head up here to the Yamashita Farm. And we're gonna go ahead and do this. Alright, so we're gonna move across here. And, well, what is this guy gonna say? This is our farm! We raise flowers here! My job is to watch over the farm! We Amigas depend on these flowers for sust sustenance. Red flowers, though, are bad news. Feed red flower, they say your blood starts to boil. And soon you'll fall. And soon you'll fall over dead. Good thing we don't have any of those going around here, though. Uh huh. Okay, so this obviously is a sprinkler. <laughs> it's obviously a sprinkler. Anyway, going in here. Yeah. Life capsule. Uh, increased by another three. So as you can see, we now have nine. Every time you get, a, as I said before, every time you get a health capsule, you get a nine. Oh, uh, this game is so fun, though. Okay, moving on, going on a fun adventure. I'm gonna go ahead and go down here. And, uh, okay, so 
we're gonna go in here. It won't open. It won't open! Open! Why are you? Oh, it leveled me down. You bitch, you took my two number two gun. Save me, save me! Huh? You're, you're not with the doctor? Oh, I'm sorry. You had me worried. The doctor's such a mean guy, popping up in our village and taking us away. Sometimes you're killing us. Like my brother. You killed my brother. Oh, a pivot! You found it for me? Sue gave it to me. Well, I shouldn't have it anymore. He gets his ears all in a tangle when he sees Sue and I get along. Who could have it? Huzzah! There you are! You! You can't hide, no, no! I've got nose of a bloodhound! Mm, indeed you do. The nose and I dare say the brain as well. Why, you- I found her first! You- you guys are with the doctor, aren't you? So you're Sue, eh? A doctor has called for you. Come along now. Oh, uh, what? I'm not Sue. Good <laughs> Balrog, I'll leave the rest of you. No way! Not again! I always have to clean up. And here I found her first. So what's your deal? You gonna fight me with that thing? Uh, yeah. I knew it! Okay. okay, so we gotta kill this guy here, and uh, I'm not doing so hot right now. Reach, Jesus. You know, maybe if I had fucking my level 2 gun, this would be so much easier. Oh. Nope. Uh. Oh. oh! Easy there, buddy. What the ball rob? Yay! Bling bling! Sparkle sparkle. There we go, I leveled up again. Yep, now I got to shoot two things again. Alright. So, now I need to find King again. Now that... Whatever his face is taken. Torco? Torco. Uh... Let's go save real quick. Restore my health. Save. Uh, Alright, so we're gonna go through here. And I do believe King is in the assembly her. Alright, so yeah, there's King. Well, understanding geometry with his math skills. The key to Arthur's house. I thought it was that the least one. I thought there was at least one other one made. Blast you, Torco! Acting like you didn't know. Well, maybe Jack knows where to find it. Well, now we gotta go talk to Jack. Jack. What? Torko's been kidnapped? Oh no! I've got to tell the king right away! I've got to tell the king man right away! Uh, Jack, you gotta, you know, let me know what, 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 The two keys to Arthur's house! Torko has one of them! The other is hidden in the Namika graveyard! Well, so. Anyway, going through that, we have to actually go, obviously, into the Mika graveyard and unlock it. And, uh... Oh, Aww, he's so cute. Yeah. Oh, fucking shit. Okay. You supposed to be like a frog or something? Oh, 16 damage. There we go. Let me hit that level 3 mark, please. Here, kill all the little cute little puffy things that look like they're from Princess Mononoke. Spirits from Princess Mononoke. Kill all 
all y'all vests. Come around here and uh, get my key. This is Arthur's grave. Is this something written on it? Here lies this noble author, true hero to the Mavigas. And you get a key. How about that? Uh, so after that, we go ahead and move on. There's a door up here. I do not know how to get into it, though. It's, it's got to find some sort of item or something. I don't know, but we're going to go ahead and move back. Um, all right, so we're going through here. Got your key. And uh, we're going to go down here. Okay. And lovely, there's no fall damage. Arthur's house. You start this key. Alright, I'm gonna save it here. And I think this is all that I'm gonna do for the midnight run. Uh I will do let's plays of this, so stay tuned for uh, the let's play of this episode one, which would actually be part two of this. So it's the whole point of me going to this continue zone. Um, let's save it just to make sure. Anyway, game saves. So this lab looks like I, I don't understand. It's a lab, but it's also uh, this is like a pool or a bath or something. Oh, well, it's obviously deep enough for me to drown. And. Uh, Flowers. Oh, these are the these are the um the 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 the, the, the red flowers that we were talking about. It's gonna like like kill the hell out of me. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it a day. Oh, that's on the screen. All right, thanks guys. So if you like this game, go ahead and I'll have a link in the description for the free version. But you know what? Check this out. Uh, go ahead and support if you really like this game. Support the developers. This really support them. Get, get it on Steam. I mean, it is $9.99, but it does give you HD capabilities and probably more stuff that's like you know, way more updated than what you see from the uh, see from what I'm playing. Because right now I'm playing this on like what 640 by 480 type resolution. Uh, so yeah, go ahead and like really check out this game. Thanks Studio Plus for. I mean, it's uh, the Studio Pixel. Thanks, Studio Pixel, for giving me this game. Uh, and I'm gonna go ahead and go to sleep. Ah, see what I did there? Yeah, midnight run. I'm out. I mean, it's 2:41 in the morning. I tried to do this at midnight, did not work out. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and get some sleep.